early in the tournament. This should be a fun bout, ladies and gentlemen. As you see, you see the bounce, you know, even before we begin. Just the way he moves around his own corner, you know. He's a fun boxer to watch, ladies and gentlemen. So here we are. It is the semifinals, ladies and gentlemen. And again, you're talking about a qualified boxer, ladies and gentlemen, in Trindade, you know, from Brazil. Qualified at 51 kilograms, ladies and gentlemen. So it's that. Uh, when you talk about this being an Olympic preview, this tournament being that, that is exactly what it is. And when you are an individual that may not be a qualified boxer, this is certainly a, quite the feather in your cap to be here on the, on the semifinal, in the semifinals of this tournament, with an opportunity to box not just for the in the finals, you know, and win this tournament, and win gold in this tournament. But if you can do so by going through an individual like Michael Trindade from Brazil, a a qualified Olympian, wow. Well, I tell you what, that makes it even better. And that is the task at hand right now for Miles OK. OK from Germany, boxing out of the red corner. As you see, Trindade. And you see the confidence in this young man. And I'm not saying both boxers aren't, but there's a reason why boxers excel. And it's not just boxing, it's just in life. When some individuals excel to the, to, to the top, to the height of whatever it is, whatever category you're in, whatever industry, whatever, whatever, you know, there's a reason why some do, and confidence is a big part of it. And Trindaji has plenty of it. Working behind the jab is Trindaji. You see that sweeping left hook by OK. Both boxers doing a pretty good job of staying within the range of their opponent without taking any punishment at the moment. It speaks to the experience of both. That is a great angle that we're looking at right now, ladies and gentlemen. You see the laser-like focus of Miles OK. Now trying to work behind him. Yeah. Big shout out to the EMS team making their way through. Yeah. It's nice to know that you're doing OK. Feel free to, to you know, examine me at any time. <laughs> Back to the action inside of the ring. And again, you see the patience and confidence of both boxers, but you can also see, you know, Trindaji taking a little bit more chances to explore what he can and can't do with OK. We'll see what the, uh, what the uh, judges at ringside think about that first round. And I guarantee you, ladies and gentlemen, you're going to see an uptick in the action in that second round. And there you have it. All five judges at ringside give that first round to the blue corner in Michael Trindaji. Again, qualified Olympian here doing what you would expect him to do. And when you, when you think about a gentleman like Miles OK, Know, who boxed well in that first round as well, came up with an empty sack on all five cards. So now the conversation in that red corner, you expect him to be a bit more aggressive and now maybe he takes a few more chances and that puts us in a position where we get to see much more action here in the second round, potentially. We'll see how that goes. I am David Austin, ladies and gentlemen. Thanking you guys for being here. World Boxing and USA Boxing International Invitational. It is the World Boxing Cup. Welcoming you guys, all the people watching us, our worldwide audience who may be joining us on the World Boxing Platform. Thank you so much for being here. The center, at least for now, of the international boxing world here in Pueblo, Colorado at the Convention Center. As you see, Miles OK taking the same posture he did in the first round coming forward. 
some dodging. Doing a good job of keeping Trinidad and keeping OK at bay. As you see the chance starting, you hear the chance starting to begin here in the arena. And if you are Michael Trinidad, getting the nod on all five cards after that first round. That gives you the freedom to be, able, to be even more patient, if you will. The judges at ringside agree with what you're doing. No need to make it any different. If it ain't broke, they say. So now comes the question for Miles OK. When you see, he didn't take any real punishment in the first round. But that first round given unanimously to your opponent. So now there are some things that you are going to need to do differently. And so far in the second round, not much has changed for Team Germany in that red corner. Reaching with the right hand is okay. Now stepping forward, throwing the right hand, he's trending it, trend dodging. exchange in the center of the ring doesn't net either boxer much of anything okay trying to jab to the body of the Brazilian Okay, jabbing toward the body, then trying to come upstairs with that same jab. Not a bad idea. Now reaching to the body of Trindade with the right hand is okay. But probably not enough. To sway the judges at ringside from where they were after round number one. You hear that sound, 10 seconds left here in round number two, ladies and gentlemen. As OK comes forward, and that right hand may be the best one of the bout so far from OK. I don't know if it's enough to change the minds of the judges, but a nice way to punctuate that round, I would guess that the Brazilian Michael Trindade will get the nod on the second round as well. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, there you have it. You can call it right now, 12.44, mountain time, it is official. I have no idea what I'm talking about. Four of the five judges at ringside give that round to Miles OK, and maybe it was on the strength of the, of, of, the, of, the, of the signature that he put on that round. The action in the second round looked pretty much the same as it did in the first, but toward the end of that second round, Miles OK did his best work in the contest so far. And maybe that was enough to give him that round. I like what he was able to do. And now we've got a whole new ball game. And now let's see who takes the initiative. And quickly, Trindade out to the center of the ring. And he is met by Miles OK. Doubling up on the jab is Trindade. Now throwing the right hand behind him. Right hand over the top by OK. And, and, and you know, right now, Trindade is being a little more aggressive than he has been in this contest. And that is going to create opportunities as well for OK. OK taking advantage of that opportunity, landing the overhand right. Right hand by Trindade. You saw the little smirk on the face of Miles OK, acknowledging it, but like, nah, I'm not going to give you credit for it. And this, as you hear the chant in the arena, as Miles OK lifts the Brazilian off the mat briefly. You gotta love the chats, the chants, if you will, from the international crowd. Miles 
Miles OK again lifts Trinidad off the mat. This time trying to deposit him onto it. Jabbing to the body with the right hand is OK. I like the movement of Miles OK right now, boxing out of that red corner from Germany. Again, taking on a bona fide and qualified Olympian in Michael Trindale from Brazil. Good jab by both gentlemen, but you saw the head of Trindade being pushed back more by Miles. The official cautioning the German to keep his head up. Good jab by OK. And now Trindade. Firing down at the head of Miles OK as we march toward the end of this contest, ladies and gentlemen. 1-1 one, one going into the third round. And now Miles OK getting inside, trying to work to the body. Trinidad passing up the opportunity to return the favor of lifting his opponent off the mat. That sound says it's 10 seconds left, and this is where OK made hay in round number two. Let's see if he tries to do so again as he steps forward and throws the left hook upstairs. And that takes us to the end of the contest. And this will be a fun one, ladies and gentlemen. I can't wait to see the scores on this one. Trindade, qualified Olympian. One of nine qualified Olympians participating in this tournament from Brazil. His opponent from Germany. Not so lucky. That doesn't matter today. Today, it's about World Boxing, USA Boxing, International Invitational, World Boxing Cup. And Miles OK right now, standing in the center of the ring along with his opponent, Michael Trindade. Let's go to Ryan Nico for the official word. The judges have a four-one split decision for your winner, Boxing There you have it, ladies and gentlemen, a 4-1 split decision. Boxing out of the blue corner, it is Michael Trindade getting the victory over Miles O.K. Again, a qualified Olympian, ladies and gentlemen. And it's moments like this where you see the experience start to show the difference between 